Hello everybody, this is the Noble GJN, and today we are reviewing the Alvin's Wand Makers, the Ash Wand. Okay, so guys, as you said, we this is the Alvin's Wand. So anyway, this, I think, is a dollar more expensive than it would on the internet for the Noble Collection Wands. Those are 35, these are 36, depending on which wand you get. Some ones are more expensive than others for their quality and their more expensive wood because these actually are made out of real real wood, so it's really nice. Because as the noble collection ones are, they are made out of resin, which is a kind of expensive sort of plastic. But anyway, starting out, let's open up the box. Now, if you can see, this might look like an H on the camera, but these are actually two, I don't know, lions breathing out fire. Find the background, Alvin's Master of Wand Makers. So I think it's supposed to be kind of doing Ollivander's, Alvin's Ollivander's kind of thing. Now this also has, some of the wands do, some of the wands don't, but this is kind of the certificate, certificate of authenticity, Alvin sticker, ash, 14 and a fourth inches. But this is from the classic collection, they have five collections. I don't really know all the names, but www.alvins.com, certificate of authenticity, Please use it wisely. I think they try to make it seem like it's really an actual wand because they have the wand thing, they have the spell books, they have the you please use it wisely. They have what it's best best used for, charms, transfiguration, whatever you want to call it. So anyway, this is kinda like the thing that comes in. We kept it because it's kinda a nice thing. But anyway, it says Alden's. And then if you come out it has, it comes with this. Most of them come with this. Not all of them come with this box, but most of them would. Now this starts out with a very nice carrying case, I guess you could call it. Tightens up, just pull these two strings. But it's really nice. I mean, it has a little symbol. I don't know what it's made out of, but it's really nice. So anyway, just however you open these things up. Pull it. And then inside, depending on how long the wand is, is a pretty long. Here comes out the wand. Now this is much lighter than the Noble Collection wands. So anyway, this is the wand. Anyway, it's made, as it is, it's made out of ash. It actually is made out of ash. These are actually real wood. They're much lighter than the Noble Collection wands. Um, but anyway, as I said in my previous videos, these actually have a rounded tip. They're really nice. They're much nicer than those little chipped off that they have in the Noble Collection. But the Noble Collection is still pretty good, don't get me wrong. But I think these, I think they really do, these are really nice. But um, these also aren't trying to, I don't know, um, they're, they're not really making wands from the Harry Potter films. They're making wands for Harry Potter fans, as it said when you open up to the page. But it's kind of like your own kind of wand, I guess, they're trying to make it. But it isn't like they're trying to get a Harry Potter wand. But anyway, so the handle, first of all at the bottom, it has this little nubby thing kind of on the other wand, Dumbledore's wand. Then it comes up. The handle's pretty long, I mean, like, for this kind of wand. Um, then it kind of ovals out kind of thing here. goes up. And the shaft is pretty straightforward. I mean, it kind of makes it look like a tree sort of thing. I mean, it comes down to make it look like the rings of a tree, if you're ever good at forest trees, whatever you want to call it, but, um, yeah, I mean, it's a really nice wand, Alvins.com, most of the classics, the classic collection is $36, this one was $36, 14 and a fourth inches, so yeah, this, this is the Alvin's wand, thank you guys, see ya.